Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Downtown Laurel. We're coming to you live from the Cosmic Deli. Uh, joined now by Kendra Keys and Stony Boy. Again, thank you to Central Sunbelt Federal Credit Union. Thank you to the Shabby Sheet Cake, to Flickus Tax Service. Uh, again, a big shout out to Hattiesburg Tattoo, Hub City Madness. And that's pretty much it for right now, huh, Ken? For right now. But the list hey, shall grow. The list shall grow. And it might go on and on and on, but uh, we're talking to Stony Boy of Hub City Madness and Hattiesburg Tattoo. Uh, welcome back, Stony Boy, and you know we're talking Hub City Madness. And uh, tell us about, you know, uh, during the break, you know, or before the break, you were really talking to us and telling us about how, you know, um, you know, the the music lineup and how you guys have uh, just a a lot of different uh, kinds of music, and I know one of our guests that will be featured in Hub City Madness, Brother Josh, is going to be performing uh, there at the Thirsty Hippo. Yep. Tell us about yep. the dates and the times and, and where where it will be. Well, um, you know, it's, uh, it's going to be at the Thirsty Hippo. That's, that's the home of Hub City Madness. It's, it's you know, where we started it all four years ago, and, nice. you know, Brad doesn't kick us out, and we'll you know continue to have it there. Um, but yeah, Brad's been awesome. I can't. We we couldn't have done this without him. We appreciate you know him letting us use his venue and his place of business to put this on. Um, yeah, as far as, as far as the you know bands when we when we first put this on, it was mainly kind of shed light on the the heavier side of you know what Hattiesburg Music Scene has to offer, but. Uh, it's just grown so much over the the uh, the past couple of years that you know we we just there's so many bands out there you know that that are awesome that you know people people enjoy coming out and listen to and you know, we're just trying to trying to get it all out there. Okay, so we'll talk about the process for an artist you know getting featured on the in the Hub City bands. What do they have to do to, to get their name out there? Um. Well. Mainly, uh, we look out, you know, how active a band is. Okay. Uh, like, we have a bunch of uh, bands around here that tour on a regular basis. Um, we've got, uh, I know, uh, Elder, a uh, black metal band here in Hattiesburg. They they just tore out for you know, two weeks and did a, did a little run through the... through the, uh, through the southeast. And uh, Dylan Kern, uh, who's huge, you know... Huge staple in the Hattiesburg music scene. He's okay. he's always on the road, you know. Not only you know uh, getting getting his, him and his bands out there, but you know they everybody does a really good job of you know promoting everybody's music. And, uh, but uh, as far as you know, just yeah, you know, like I said, act, you know how active they are. You know, it's got to be original music. Okay, right, um, right. And I know. I guess since we're kind of into more. You know, underground that's that's where it kind of points towards like punk metal right. folk uh heavy blues uh that that sort of deal okay. and this event um you say it's been going on for four years now is that correct yeah four years okay and do y'all have just one show year. a year or is it, does it last um a couple of days or um what's the layout of the show um we'll start on uh start on saturday and uh just goes until you know uh i guess I guess, I, mean, I guess we got to cut off round two, but you know, we'll see. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's uh, you know we keep it cheap. You know we want everybody to show out. Um, 
I think is I believe it's eight dollars for both days, or if you know if you can just make it a one day. You know, it's okay. five dollars. Okay, not bad at all. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, it'll continue on until Sunday, so you got a whole weekend. Okay. Well, that's always good stuff. I mean, I'm a music lover myself, and it's just so strange that I'm, I'm like the last one to ever hear about events going on like this. And I'm like always wondering why do I never hear about events going on like this because I believe, you know, this is a big area that we're in, there, and there's a lot of musicians and artists here, but they always tell me that there is no way for me to showcase my talent, so I'm always looking for events like this. So, I mean, I mean, hats off to you for, you know, pulling off such a great event and making it happen. And I mean, I hope it, you know, can you guys can continue to do this for uh, several years to come and exactly, I mean, make it so big that you have to probably take it to another location or something, you know, just to accommodate the... Yeah, I mean, that'd be wonderful, you know, we're just, we're just, uh, you know, stay, steady rolling as it comes, you know, eventually we'd like to, you know, kind of break out of, you know, rock and maybe open up to hip-hop and, you know, other sort of forms of, you know, other forms of music. Well, that's wonderful, uh, Stony Boy, and again... You know, we thank you for, uh, you know, you and Brian over there for, for coming on and, and, you know, taking a shot with us. And, uh, you know, we uh, hope you guys succeed, and uh, we hope that uh, we have a long-lasting relationship. And, uh, you know, we'll be coming live from oh, yes. Hub City Madness, and we're looking yeah, forward right, to that. Yeah, that's right, man. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. Out. It's going to be a good time. Absolutely. So uh, we're going to have to ha- get some energy drinks and uh, a lot of Diet Mountain Dew that day, huh? I can get something. They made me something a little stronger. but <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. So uh, maybe a little moonshine whiskey or something. I don't oh, know. There we go. There we go. You come find me. All right. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, Stony Boy, thank you so much for hanging on and hanging out with us today. And, uh, look, uh, we're looking forward to coming out and uh, – Tell us the dates again for uh, Hub City Madness. It's uh, it's March twenty fourth, twenty fifth, okay. Saturday and Sunday. Mark that down. Uh, we 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 uh, we don't have an event page up at the moment, and I'm I'm slacking. You know, um, I just uh, confirmed the last of the bands a few days ago, but uh, we will have an event page up, and we'll have all all the information you need to, you know. Okay, well, that's good stuff. Everything you need on there. So. All right. Well, uh, Stony Boy, hey, thank you for uh, coming on with us. Yeah, I appreciate us, it, John. Uh, I, I mean, I had a lot of fun on here today, and, uh, you know, you guys are doing a good thing. Like I said, I'd never heard of of uh, the band that was on earlier, but, you know, I'm hell, I'm going to go check it out. You know, that was cool. I, I was into it. So. Hey, and you can thank, check. Thank you, guys. Hey, thank you. And you can check them out on Spotify, Midnight Ruffle. Right on. All right. Well, thanks again. And so. Uh, we'll t- talk to you, uh, you know, next week and hopefully get Brian on to talk with us. Hey, that'd be perfect, man. Brian loves to talk. All right, good deal. <laughs> well, we're looking forward to talking with him. So thank you, Stony Boy, and we'll talk to you next time. All right, y'all have a good weekend. Take care. You too. Bye-bye. All right. Well, how about that, Ken? Man, that's good stuff. We're just moving on along and getting bigger and bigger every yeah, week. Indeed. I just love events like that. we got to get out and get to these events, Yeah, too. we got just, to. We, I mean, we can find these local talents, too. Too. Yeah, so much talent around here that you know needs promotion and needs a mm-hmm. push. So because I mean, that's what we do is promote. Right, we're promoters. That's it. And that's like we're about to do, you know, I had a spicy beef sandwich today from Cosmic Deli in downtown Laurel here at Sawmill Square Mall. And let me tell you something, folks. It's right here beside the movie, so can't miss it. You can't miss it. It's got the cinema. I mean, look at it over here. I mean, the the, the brown wooden. Yeah, it's the most unique place in the It's the home. unique, you know, and it's right here by Belk, so it's easy to find. Yeah, and I bet my sandwich was better than yours, John. No, I, I don't I don't know about that. Mine was was pretty good itself. Well, you know what? Let's let the people decide. So we'll yeah. challenge you, the listeners, to come up here and, and check and, out Cosmic Come and Deli. check them out and tell them you heard about it on uh, something to talk about. I had a buddy of mine uh, come up, uh, old David Lyons down there. He's a school resource officer at uh, South Jones, and he's like, well, John, he goes, uh, what do I need to get at Cosmic Deli? And I said, well, you can't really go wrong with anything over there. Uh, right. And so. Uh, it's like last week I had yeah. um, Chicken Baker Ranch Club, and then today I had the Mushroom Swiss Burger. So, hey, we'll just challenge our listeners to come up here and, and try one of those. And what did you have, John? The I had the spicy. Uh, spicy beef, and 
Hey, we, we got a visitor walking by. Oh, hello. How are you? And this is Chico, who owns uh, um, Mika Cedars here in Laurel. Oh, good stuff. Chico, what's happening, buddy? How are you today? Fine. How are you guys? What you guys doing here? We, well, we got a show here, uh, you know, something to talk about. What kind of show this is this? Yes, hey, we, we, we talk, talk about everything. We can talk about everything right here? Yeah. Okay, well, I don't have much to say right now. All right. Hey, well, thank you, Chico. Thank you for stopping by. How about that, Chico coming over here that's talking to stuff. us? That's good stuff. Make a seat. That's good hey, stuff. Hey, make a seat. This is always good to eat. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir, it is. So, uh, all right, that's always fun. Yeah, but you're going to um, talk about the listeners to come check, yeah. check out this good food and see what they think. You know, I, I like all kinds of food. I like Mexican. I like uh, Italian. Yeah. Uh, and, and I like, you know, one thing I don't like are the cold sandwiches. Really? Yeah. I, yeah, for lunch they're okay, but maybe <laughs> like a ham sandwich, ham sandwich. Oh. with a little mayonnaise oh. on top. Oh man, ain't nothing like those. But I tell you sandwich. what, that spicy beef was uh. outstanding. And let's get Mitchell over here to talk to us. Yeah, let's tell us what you. Got. You know, the what Super Bowl you? is coming up. You, do, do you realize that the that like next week? It's coming. I mean. You know, I I, I, I I hadn't even mentioned this because we've been so busy on the show today. We have. You know, getting engaged last night, you know. You're showing out, John. Showing out, you got. You know, but it's yeah. for a good cause. Yeah, it's, it's good, for a good, good cause, good. you yeah. know. I'm proud of you. You know, her birthday's next Sunday. Oh, man. Okay. And then you got Valentine's. Oh, man. Your pockets are going to be kind of slim. Filled with air. Yeah. <laughs> so. We need more sponsors. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but uh, no, it's always good to have a good time. I like to joke and pick around, but uh, wrong with that. we've got Mitchell on with us now. And uh, Mitchell, you know, this food every week. You know, Kinsley was like, I, "It's my goal to try every something, you know, something new every week." And you didn't disappoint again, my friend. Well, we appreciate that. You know, we're going to try to mix it up every week. So when you think you finish the menu, we're going to throw a new kink in there and mm. we're have something different. But you're not going to go wrong. We're going to take care of you guys. All right. Well, see, that's the challenge right there, Kinsley. Um, you know, and, and he come up to me and goes, he goes, I know y'all like the cheesecakes. Oh, yes. But we're out. Uh, and, you know, we're, you know, we're tigers. We love challenges. Yeah, we love challenges. We never back down. Yeah, yeah. Them tigers need to do something. And you know what's interesting, John? What I tried – Today uh -huh. is what I was going to get last week. But see, the thing is, I saw the bacon. That's yeah, I had to try the chicken bacon ranch club. I mean, a man ain't going to turn down bacon. They're not. You know, because bacon bacon is the best. Is the best. It's 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 the real deal. Yeah, but you know what the thing is about this food is just, it's all good. I mean, you can't really get nothing bad here. You and, can't. And the bread comes all the way from New Orleans at Gambino's. And I love New Orleans. I do too. Yeah. There's nothing bad in New Orleans. We may have to be going down to New Orleans here in a little, well, in a few months. Yeah, but if you want to taste New Orleans, just come to Cosmic Deli. Yeah. And then, then they add their own special touch. And, and I mean, you don't have to go all the way to Crescent City Grill to, to taste New Orleans. No. It's, it's just, you can come right here to the Laurel Mall. Exactly. The best. Go do right shopping here. at Belk. Come by and get you something to eat. Go to the movies. There you go. You know, and Mitchell, what what's your special this week? Because I know... You can get, you know, a, something different every day, and, you know, it's going to be good regardless of, of what you get. Well, we do a lot of different specials. Today we didn't really have one being Saturday, but yesterday we had a very unique special. We had a shrimp fried rice uh, with a uh, sweet chili sauce with it, a little bit of soy. We had a little soy sauce and had just a touch of heat but not too much with some uh, grilled broccoli and green onions. It was great. We had redfish tacos this week, which are all are really nice. You know, nice black and redfish and a tortilla, lettuce, our jalapeno, cilantro, sauce is great. Uh, we even did, we have a couple specials for our vegan friends. And always someone's coming, I'm a vegetarian, I'm a vegan, what can you do for me? We had a great black bean wrap. Had black beans, grilled corn, uh, grilled onions in that. We put a concentrate chipotle sauce on lettuce, so different things like that. Okay, well... How about that, Ken? That is.